dude, tell me why, tell me why YouTube almost took down my channel right now. Like, literally, almost. I'm hanging on a thread, people. Look, these fuckers, they can't do this to me now. Not now! All right? As you can see, this video, I literally, I was so freaking, I was so baffled that I went back onto my channel real quick. Like, as soon as I asked somebody, like, to look up one of my playlists because I have a lot of music that I still haven't saved. Damn, that was tripping. Oh man, this dude was like super speeding right now. <clears throat> They're probably targeting him. But anyways, this the third strike, you see that red card? It says, we've issued you a third strike against your account and your, or your account has permanently been removed from YouTube. Dude, I was literally trying to get to my videos. Everything that I've ever uploaded, erased from the database, from, you know, all the work that I've put into creating this channel for, to make people aware and to share the truth has been taken, taken out of the game. But I called a few people and they threw in some prayers, but not only that, I did another video right after that and I said how I was going to delete my Google account. I said, you know what? If they want to delete my YouTube channel, this 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 email address has been with me for years and it's linked up to a lot of data. So if I literally if I erase this email address and I changed any accounts that I have, you know, my uh, bank account or any accounts that I'm using this email under and switched it, updated everything to another email and then deleted this this email. Uh, I, I didn't think they wanted that. So when they heard me talking about that, they that's one reason that they put I think that they put my channel back up. Another reason is I think the reason that they gave me a third strike wasn't even it was some BS because it says right here, um, violates our spam. Unfortunately, we think it violates our spam deceptive practices and scams policy. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like I'm, I'm sharing a frequency that heals. And this was the video that they, um, that they took down that they gave me the third strike for and I was just like what the hell is going on here but then um I seen these after right after I guess my account was put back up I got four copyright claims on videos but they're not strikes and pretty much this is just them trying to tell me like to be careful what I'm uploading because I'm like on a thin hair and literally on the 24th which is 10 days from now I'm going to two of my strikes are going to fall off so I'm going to have a fresh slate and so YouTube don't be such a stickler I haven't even made a live video on your platform yet because you make it so hard to get a thousand subscribers because you've been freaking hindering our channels all of people that speak about truth you hinder the shit out of our channels and then you want to try to delete our shit so stop being a fucking sore asshole and let us fucking have this little bit of truthers that are left which are very few because everybody has gone corrupt and let us freaking you know what i mean like have our little platform we have still left of truth we can work together whatever little bullshit you guys don't want me saying i can alter it or tweak it change the name to it whatever even though i just like saying it telling it like it is but like say they don't want you saying covid so you'll say like c19 or you'll say 
We'll call it fucking the fucking Juju B, whatever. You want to fucking name it different names just so that, you know, it's not picked up by the algorithm or by... Because they're they're stepping on these fucking people's necks too. And they're pressuring them and telling them, you know, we don't want this fucker speaking the truth. And, you know, and they pressure their asses, you know, these people up there running shit. So... Um, so yeah, let's see if I can make it to the 24th because I just at least want to be able to make one live video. And then I just got to be careful on like really matters that are like have to do with like Black Lives Matters or George, George Floyd or like CV, CV19. Like if you talk any about, about any of that stuff, that's really like they're really paranoid about people talking about that. So... If you have any inputs about it You can't really speak your mind And then right here as you can see It says This is literally 55 minutes ago So I thought my, my account was history It says after we review your account We have confirmed that your YouTube account Is not in violation of terms of service As such we have Unsuspended your account This means your account is once again active and operational Oh my god So you know, dude, cross your fingers that I, I'm gonna just keep a lookout. I'm not gonna post. I'm not gonna post anything for probably to the 24th, so that I'm, I can avoid them trying to find any little thing to give me a strike for. Because they can pull up something that's old from my, that I uploaded literally like two years ago, and they'll try to say this is in this is in violation of our community, you know, guidelines, and and give me a third strike. So literally, I'm hanging on by a hair, so I don't want my YouTube channel to get deleted. This channel is to help people. So if they delete my shit, obviously, you know what the deal is. These people do not want any help. They don't want no people speaking truth. They don't want shit. So stay tuned.